Closed-loop controls and electric servo motors contribute to the accuracy and repeatability of all electric molding machines. Electric molding machines use closed-loop controls. Closed-loop process control systems are designed to automatically correct variations in the process. In essence, electric measuring devices such as transducers are used to measure the process outputs, while a feedback loop is used to transfer process outputs to the closed-loop process control system. A microprocessor is then used to evaluate the process outputs for variations and make the necessary corrections. For example, as the screw travels forward during injection, a transducer measures the position of the screw. The microprocessor uses the time and position to determine the speed of the screw. The power applied to the injection servo motor is adjusted to maintain the desired injection speed. Electric molding machines use electric servo motors. Since the components are powered by electric servo motors, the adjustments provided by the controller take place immediately. This allows the machine to maintain very accurate velocities, positions, and timing. Many of these machines can maintain fill times repeatable to hundredths of a second. The first electric molding machines use an earlier generation of servo motors which tended to overheat and often fail. The latest servo motors are very capable. Each new generation of servo motor is more reliable, accurate, and efficient than its predecessor. Newer electric molding machines generally use the latest and greatest technologies.